Yes, baby. Brilliant effort from Fernando Alonso. One of the bravest, isn't he? In 2022, it's round two. Welcome then to Jeddah. Haven't driven here with the 2022 cars, which is supposed to be able to run a lot closer. So we should have more of it taking opportunities. And the two Alpines going for it. Fernando Alonso almost in the wall, certainly in the dust, and still behind his teammate, Esteban Ocon. Here comes Fernando Alonso. Ocon just pushes him a little bit wide this time around. But Fernando Alonso is right on the tail of Esteban Ocon. And I'm sure he's on the radio telling the team that he should be allowed past. Here we go, Fernando Alonso gets past Esteban Ocon. Can he make the move stick? Goes deep into the corner. Ocon is going to fight this back again, you know, and has to concede. Great move from Fernando Alonso. We're racing in the States and it's lights out. Away we go. It's a great reaction from Fernando Alonso. Lewis Hamilton under pressure from Fernando Alonso in the Alpine. It's a sunny Sunday in Spain. Welcome along to the Spanish Grand Prix. Ferrari on pole, but Fernando Alonso, who won here for Ferrari, starting at the back. Complete power unit change, he's 20th. Don't forget, started right at the back, told Natalie Pinkham, couldn't get any worse, but it certainly got a lot better. Now here's DRS for Fernando Alonso down the main straight. He's in 14th place at the moment. He might not be as he get in a turn one and he was almost on the grass. Dramatic stuff from Fernando Alonso. Uh, Fernando Alonso puts himself up into the points. A little bit of bouncing at the end of the straight there, but he'll be bouncing for joy, I'm sure, as he gets past uh, Mick Schumacher and into ninth place. Nice job. So good recovery from where we started. Yeah, it's ready to start last uh, P5. <laughs> Score points. Good job, guys. Look at that sliding his way out of the final corner. Dramatic finale from Fernando Alonso, who goes up to the front row. Brilliant effort from Fernando Alonso. And boy, oh boy, does a sellout Montreal crowd absolutely love that. Wow. Young man. <laughs> Here in Montreal, on the front row, you almost had it. How does that feel? Yeah, it feels great. I mean, uh, this was uh, an unbelievable weekend so far for us. But yeah, thanks to the wet conditions today, the car was mega. I think the fans also pushed me to, to make an extra push. This is Fernando Alonso and Yuki Tsunoda. And Fernando Alonso is so experienced, he can go half on the grass and yet still get a decent track. And then wag a finger at Yuki Tsunoda as he tries to get past him. And he did get past him, and he's up into 16. It's lights out, and away we go. George Russell making a challenge on Perez. There is Fernando Alonso swooping around the outside and up into fourth place. Great start. Here we go with Fernando, which way does he go, left or right? He almost went straight down the middle, but he did manage to avoid Pierre Gasly, and he makes that move into Tarzan corner. So P6, P6, an amazing job. Cheers, buddy. Thank you, guys. Good weekend. Ooh, very orange. Very orange, yeah. yeah. Like last year, put your fox lights on. Fernando Alonso, you start your 350th race, P5, a great day yesterday, but let's just reflect on that achievement, 350 races. Yeah, I mean, obviously a lot of 20 plus years in Formula 1, so yeah, uh, sharing magic moments with, uh, you know, my teammates, uh, everybody here in the paddock, uh, but most importantly, I think is 20 years uh, performing on, on a high level, like today, starting P5, that's probably what it makes me more proud than, than the number itself. What, what position we ended up? Okay, that's um, the timing screen here, it says 7th, uh, just behind Petal. Fernando Alonso goes off the track, that's a high speed crash, and he's made contact with Lance Stroll in the Aston Martin. That is a big moment down the back straight. You okay? 
yes, mate. Very late boss. Well, Fernando Alonso might be able to keep going. Lance Stroll, no chance to keep going. This makes me win, this one. Oh, see, this time he went right. Yeah. It worked uh, out a lot better for yeah. him. And Fernando Alonso making his way then uh, past the hat of Kevin Magnussen. Might be the oldest man on the track, but he's one of the bravest, isn't he? <laughs> Five lights, and in Mexico City, it's lights out, and away we go. Okay, that's really good stuff. One last point, four behind. There's all the big available if you need it. Fernando Alonso and his battle uh, with Alex Albon. Nice bit of driving. Alonso, who's just making moves everywhere we look at the moment. This time he's picked off uh, Yuki Tsunoda and up now into 13th. Fernando Alonso trying to make a move on Valtteri Bottas and it didn't quite come off for Bottas. Looking like he was struggling, getting the power down. We head towards Ferragura, Bottas glad that he's got the inside line here, but Alonso goes around the outside anyway. And Fernando Alonso up in the sixth place. Next. Leclerc next. All Perez now trying to fend off Fernando Alonso. Dive down to the left-hand side. Alonso saw him coming, wanted to go around the outside. Knows he's going to get decent traction out of uh, the curve of the sole. And with a bit of DRS down the rest of Aposta, he's got another chance. And look at the speed that the Alpine's got. Getting past Sergio Perez. That's one, baby. Yes, baby. Seb is part of my career, I think, because we, we shared so many good years together on uh, fighting for the championships. You know, I will miss him a lot.